Hi everyone, how are you doing? It's Friday evening and I hope you're all okay. So, this weekend I want you to think about something. I've got some books here and I want you to choose what you want to hear being read. Uh, and the book that gets the most votes, I'll read to you over YouTube over the next couple of weeks. So we've got some chapter books here. And the first one is a recommendation from Mrs Buttress and Danny Buttress and it's called Planet Omar, Accidental Trouble and Magnet and it's written by Zanid Mian and illustrated by Nasea Mafaridic and it's all about a young boy having to start a new school and uh, how, he, how he gets settled in and the blurb says this Welcome to the imaginative brain of Omar You might not know me yet but once you open this book you will laugh so hard that snot will come out of your nose. It contains a new school, a stinky class bully, a dragon and a zombie, an Eid feast, and Eid presents, and a whole heap of trouble. So that's one choice, Planet Omar. Next choice is a classic, it's George's Marvellous Medicine by Roald Dahl. Some of you will know it, some of you won't. It's not a very long story. It's the first chapter book I think I read uh, when I was at primary school, so it's quite old. Um, and all the blurb says is this. The rule would be this. Whatever he saw, if it was runny or powdery or gooey, it went in. George is a mischievous boy who wants to teach his evil grandma a lesson. Choice three is very popular with children who have had Mr Nottingham as their teacher. This is Varjak Paul by S.F. Said. Now I've not read Varjak Paul but I have read other books by S.F. Said uh, and absolutely loved them. So I'd quite like to read this one. I'd like to read all of them. Uh, the blurb says this. There are seven skills in the way of Jalal, whispered the elder Paul. We know of only three of them. Their names are the slow time, moving circles and shadow walking. Varjak Poor is a Mesopotamian blue kitten. He lives high up in an old house on a hill. He's never left home, but then his grandfather tells him about the way. Secret martial art for cats. Now Varjak must use the way to survive in a city full of dangerous dogs, cat gangs, and strangest of all, the mysterious vanishings. Sounds good. Mysterious. So we've got funny mischievous, mysterious and then lastly we've got a David Williams story called The Midnight Gang. David Williams is always popular at Mellors. Um, children often want to borrow mine and Mrs Newbold's David Williams books and this one is all about a midnight gang. Midnight is the time when most children are fast asleep except of course for the midnight gang. That's when their adventures are just beginning. So bit of an adventure. If you like the sound of any of those books, email me on Purple Mash or let me know on the Reading for Pleasure blog and the book that gets the most votes by Monday will uh, I'll start to read. Okay, happy weekend. Stay safe.